Hey, what's going on, guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. I finally got Magpie number 57. One of my good buddies, Matt Borkin, was kind enough to go to his local micro center and send me one. So this is the best Magpie that I've ever seen. It comes with a few little things. Do-it-yourself artificial intelligence. This kit comes with a voice hat, a box, a button, everything you need except for the Pi and the SD card to get Google Voice up and running. Now this is, like I said, the best one that I've seen. A few of them have come with like the Raspberry Pi Zero, but this tops it. I'm going to go ahead and get this out of the box. I'm going to build it real quick and then test it out. So this kit comes with everything you need except for the Raspberry Pi 3 and an SD card. I'm going to go ahead and throw it together real quick. I've looked over the instructions and it's very simple. They also offer a version of Raspbian with everything set up for you. All you need to do is sign into your Google Developer Portal, start a new project, and authenticate this unit here to use Google Voice. So I'm gonna put the voice hat on. This is what I'm very excited about. So now I'm just gonna wire it up. Everything's in the magazine that you need. Here's the speaker itself. You'll need a screwdriver. Make sure you have the positive going to positive, negative going to negative, so the speaker sounds correct. Screw these down. I'm just gonna go ahead and wire this up. First up, we have the button wiring for our push button. Everything's numbered, everything's labeled, so it's super easy to figure this out. We also have our mic input. We'll just plug this in here. And we're almost done. All we need to do is slide this in the cardboard box, wire up the button, and get the operating system going. Now, Google loves cardboard boxes for their projects. If you remember, a few years ago, they put out the Google VR, or I forget what it was called, but it was made out of cardboard. Well, they also sent us a cardboard box here that the Raspberry Pi and everything goes inside of. Just fold it up. Everything's marked, so you shouldn't mess it up too bad. There is a second piece of cardboard that the Pi goes on top of, and you just slide your speaker in the slot over here. So we'll move this around, slide it in the slot, and this whole thing's gonna go inside of the bigger box. So it slides down right in here. Everything fits pretty good, given that it's made out of cardboard. just need to slide that speaker down a little bit, get everything adjusted. I'm going to go ahead and install the push button. I have the button in place. The microphone needs to be taped down a little bit. It's no big deal though. Get everything snug and we're going to close this box up. I'm going to go ahead and insert my SD card and test the Google Assistant out. All right, guys, so I have everything built here. I have the operating system set up. They actually offer a very easy image that you can install. You need to do a few little things, and then you're ready to go. I'm gonna test this out here. What's the weather like in New Zealand? Right now in Wellington, it's 53 with rain. Today, there'll be heavy rain with a forecasted high of 55 and a low of 47. Tell me a joke. This might make you laugh. What did Jay-Z call his wife before they got married? Fiance. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. It was just a quick build. It wasn't a how-to or anything. I just wanted to show you this thing in action. Now, you don't need this Magpie kit to get this working. Nova Spirit Tech made a video. I'll leave a link to his channel down below. You just need a USB microphone and a Raspberry Pi 3. I want to thank Matt again. Really appreciate it, man. I looked and looked all over for this thing. They're selling on eBay for like 90 bucks, and I'm glad I got it for the $14.99. If you can find one, go ahead and pick it up as soon as possible. Barnes & Noble and Micro Center in the U.S. are the ones that sell these kits, well, these magazines. Every once in a while, the Raspberry Pi Foundation or the Magpie will put out some really cool stuff with the magazine. Like always, thanks for watching.